Authority News, and we are live from Nordstrom Woodfield. My name is Lindsay Decorino. And my name is Becky Kloss, and today we'll be discussing employee engagement. And later on, we'll have a special guest appearance, so make sure to stick around. And now we'll go to Courtney in our first story of the morning. We're here today with some of Nordstrom's top managers to discuss how we can better engage employees. Here's what they said. The best way we can engage with employees is by giving them more power within the department such as asking them whether we can re-merge in different areas and have them be more involved. So that way we can get input from everybody so that we have success and they feel like they have say in everything that we do. I keep my employees engaged by giving them ownership of a specific area of the department. This way they are invested in the success of the department as a whole. I like to ask them how their day was going and if they went to a party or event over the weekend just to see how, their, how it was and really get to know them on a better basis than before. The best way to engage with your team is by listening to them. Listen to what they have to say, listen to just listen to their feedback and their positive experiences and also their concerns and that way you will truly get to know them. Now we'll kick it over to Christina, our special guest. Thank you, Courtney. I'm here live at Nordstrom Woodfield with Frankie Pierre. Frankie, how are you today? Good, I'm doing okay. How are you? I'm doing great. Thank you so Good. much. I wanted to talk to you a little bit about how we can make Nordstrom a place where people want to work. Good question, Christine. I think um, to make Nordstrom a place where people want to work, the way I see it from a management standpoint is um, putting your team before yourself. Uh, really looking at the needs of your team before my own personal needs and how I can better uh, assist them and get them excited to be here and excited to work uh, in my department and be excited about what we're doing. Um, I think that the more uplifting environment you provide for your team, the more they kind of get that feeling with them and it kind of resonates and then everybody starts to have it happen. It's like a chain, you know, chain reaction. Um, I also think, you know, from uh, a salesperson standpoint, I would want to work here if uh, you know people are in good moods. People are not coming into work upset, and um, we like to have fun. So, not taking things too seriously, uh, putting your team before uh, your own needs, and just looking at the department as one whole group of people with all everybody has the same idea in mind. They want to come in, they want to have fun, and they want to work. Perfect. Thank you so much for being here. Now back to you, Lindsay. Now I'm here with more of Nordstrom Woodfield's top talent, and we're discussing how would you improve the work environment, and here's what they had to say. How would you improve the work environment by having something where the whole team can motivate each other rather than just the managers? I would say the best way to have more stock, more merchandise, and everybody will be happy. I think that one way would be to have department meetings. Just, I don't know, on a quarterly basis, I don't even know, like, you know, how often you'd have to do it, but I think it would be nice to share ideas and you know, get feedback. And then the other thing I thought of is, because I've been here six months, if you have an open shift at 10, you miss the rally, it might be nice just to have, you know, a little, I don't know, some, some of the people come in just a little bit early, even once a month, just to get that excitement. That's just, that's all I can think of. Just to keep it clean so that no one trips or anything. If you see something on the floor, just pick it up. Now over to you, Debbie. We're here at the Rack and we'll be talking to employees and managers about how they would improve the work environment. I think we can improve the work environment by having more people on the floor. How to create a good environment. I think it's good communication, keeping it clean, uh, friendly competition, and um, always praising too, saying thank you. I think what would better the workplace is having more department meetings and having the decisions that are made being including the entire team. The way I better improve the work environment is to keep it positive and keep the energy flowing. Usually I tell everybody to turn up that actually works, so long as you keep it positive and keep the energy going, you'll be alright. Thanks for watching Nordy News. It might seem crazy what I'm about to say.